Hey guys, it's Lays Bro. I have some bad news here. I was I was reacting to uh, MLP season eight, episode twenty three of Sound of Silence. I got about halfway through the uh, reaction to the fifteen minute marker, but then my grandmother walked in on me and I told her I can't talk right now and I had to shoo her away, which was kind of rude of me and I didn't want you guys to see that. I just I apologize to her though. I just it was really my fault. I really should have waited till everyone was out of the house. You know, it's best to do reactions when nobody's around. That way I have the house to myself and I can be, you know, talk and commentate without people walking in on me. So, sorry. You're not going to be able to see my first reaction to this episode. You're just going to have to, uh, I don't know. So, I'm sorry. So, I'm going to have to do a re-reaction. So, let's just watch this again. Reaction starting in three, two, one, go. I can't believe you two are going on a friendship quest. This is amazing. What do you mean, Twilight? We've been on one together before. That exactly. is true. This is the first time the map has teamed up the same ponies for a second quest. That is special. I think that was back in uh, extra good at Evil Lost Pegasus. Problems. Yeah. I hope so, because it looks like this one might be a little tricky. You're going to the peaks of peril. Peaks of Peril. Peaks of the, the Peril? That don't sound good. It doesn't mean anything. Like how Cloud's deal is in the clouds, and the Crystal Empire is made of crystal? Fair point. <clears throat> so, what can he tell us about the place, Twilight? Only what Rockhoof told me. Back in his day, no pony knew much about the Peaks of Peril. Except for the legend on this ancient shield. It says, a group called the Kirin used to live there, known for their kindness and truth-speaking. Now we know why the map called us. Mm hmm Unfortunately, other creatures also live there. The Neric, fearsome beasts of pure fire. Ooh, Ooh scary. Should go instead of me, Twilight. <laughs> <laughs> of course, Flutter Side's gonna check it out. Thanks, don't lie. That is true. I'm sure the two of us will get that friendship problem solved no matter what kind of creature has it. <laughs> sure you will. And here we are. Yes, no pony else is going out as far as we are. Maybe they know something we don't. Now, Fluttershy, I've told you a dozen times. There's nothing to be scared. Ah! Woo! I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you really startled us. Rippy old guy. Oh, it's just that I'm not used to seeing any pony taking the train to the end of the line. The final destination. The last stop. We need a picture. Why? Nothing but uncharted terrain and wild beasts out that way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's a creepy laugh, man. <laughs> creepy. Well, maybe there's a little something to be scared of. <laughs> Got distracted. Ew. Those must be the peaks of peril. Whew. Tough going, huh, Fluttershy? Fluttershy! <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go all the way back. Should be enough flowers to keep your tree cozy. Fluttershy, what are you doing? This is no time for visiting varmints. We're on a friendship quest, remember? Jeez, yes. calm down, Fluttershy. Applejack. Come on. We're burning daylight. I know, but what I found out is that now we gotta get up that peak. I figured if we use some rope and elbow grease, we can make it up half. Applejack, can you please listen to me? Oh, Fluttershy. What I'm trying to say is. The squirrel told me a shortcut they take to the Kirin village. <laughs> of course she asked the squirrels. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Fluttershy. I suppose I got a little too caught up in the adventure. That's all right. If you hadn't come back to get me, I probably would have talked to the squirrels all day. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Whoa. Beautiful village. <laughs> hmm. 
That's not in here, <gasps> no, I don't think so. Show yourself. Ooh, beautiful. Well, hi, I'm Applejack, and this here's Buttershy. If you have any friendship problems, we're here to help. Mm. Huh. Quiet bunch, ain't they? Yeah. <clears throat> we're from Equestria, and we're plum tickled to meet y'all. So, uh, what are your names? <laughs> Applejack, Fluttershy. Remember? Maybe they don't understand us. Do you understand Honish? Yes. Oh, but you don't speak? No. Don't or won't? Will you excuse us for a hmm. moment? You have to ask yes or no questions or they won't answer. Like talking to Angel Bunny? Not exactly. <laughs> talking to Angel Bunny. But he's curing, don't show anything. Well, how are we gonna solve a friendship problem if none of them will tell us what it is? Hmm. Oh boy. They just walk around faceless and emotionless. Quieter than an apple blossom on snowfall. Still, there's gotta be some way to make them speak. <laughs> Beautiful day, ain't it? <laughs> knock knock. There Who's there? Who's there? <laughs> Police! Police who? Police say something! <laughs> uh oh! I feel a sneeze coming on! Oh dear. <laughs> Does any of y'all talk? Mm. One does. Now we're getting somewhere. A dark, spooky path that leads into unknown territory? I'll tell you what, Sugar Cube. You stay and see if you can get anything out of these here cubes. I'll go try and find one that talks. Phew. Be careful. And watch out for Gearix! Mm hmm. A little too close there. Who's there? What's oh, a squirrel? <laughs> Boo! Oh, have you seen a cure in the talks? <laughs> Any idea where I should look? <laughs> oh, for the love of Celestia! Can't you just say something? <laughs> gotcha! Sorry, ah. sorry, but that was too good. Oh, you don't know how much I miss jokes. Hi, Larity. Am I pronouncing that right? Some words I haven't said in a while. Wild, wild. Hi, I'm Autumn Blaze. You've just arrived, and perhaps you're tired or hungry or reflective and want to sleep and eat and journal, which you should do, of course, but first, oh! She's oh very God, energetic. Creature, it's been so long. You must tell me everything about you. There's so much to say, so much to do. Oh, look at me, I'm going on, and you haven't seen... I mean, have you seen... What, um, what am I saying? Of course you haven't, so just... Uh, yeah, and she fine. rambles too much. <laughs> that was something, all right. Free rainbow. This is amazing. Oh, you think so too? The way the light shimmers off everything, like like it all suddenly woke up the moment you saw it, and you realize maybe the water and the mountains and the forest and the, yes, the rainbow and the stars in the sky are all looking back at you, thinking the same thing that we are a part of the everything. That maybe there's just one thing, and we are all it. That was a beautiful I speech. Say it's pretty, but yeah. <laughs> And this is just the first stop on a journey of amazing things to see, smell, tip them through. Oh, I haven't been able to share all of this with any pony in forever since they all took that vow of silence. So it's a lot for me to, you know, process. Process. That deal with. Okay. Whoa there. Vow of silence? That's, uh, that's why they asked me to leave. Oh. I hope it's not a sore subject, but you mind explaining why y'all went quiet in the first place? It's a long story. Too painful? <sighs> You'd rather not talk about it? No. I I'd rather see. <laughs> of course, we get a song. La, 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 the Kieran 
used to speak and sing. We weren't always quiet. We told stories and funny jokes, but Santa was a riot. <laughs> Ooh. Calm down. Well, like forced silence. And peace was soon restored. But with no way to speak my thoughts, I got super bored. Seriously, there's only so long that Sudoku can keep you entertained. <laughs> song oh, I can't believe it no pony should give up feeling their feelings just to keep from getting angry exactly I said well, you know when I started talking again oh, I bet this here's the problem that Fluttershy and I came to help y'all with mm -hmm. who's Fluttershy oh did you name your shadow mine's called silhouette gloom of the sundown lands <laughs> well, I'm thinking, that's just funny don't talk to the other Karen we can get him to welcome you back proper like Maybe even convince him to take your cure. Oh, yes, yes, of course. Oh, just one small thing. The antidote for my anecdote, it's gone. <gasps> I know where they are. I used the last of the false breath flowers to make it. And I, I have to There's seen some it more. <sighs> well, this wouldn't be a friendship quest if it was easy. I'm going to start by getting your friends to welcome you back. Good luck with that, AJ. You know, between you and me, I'm not sure she's going to convince me. <laughs> No, but I hope she does. Oh, I love her. She's funny. Guess what? I figured out the friendship problem. Me too. Get you now. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Bet that's a problem the Kira never had. <laughs> no. Anyhow, we gotta get them all talking again. Oh, no, 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 no. We can't ever let that happen. I thought you said you figured out the friendship problem. It was something lost in translation. The Kirin are usually peaceful and kind. Mm -hmm. But when they get mad, they turn into Nerex, creatures of <laughs> fire and vengeance. Yikes, that that's less scary. scary when it was in a song. The last time they all argued, they got so angry, they accidentally destroyed their whole village. So the Kirin decided to make sure it would never happen again. But that's no reason to stop talking. Yes, it is. Fire is dangerous, especially in a forest like this. Think of all the animals it could hurt. Not if they don't turn into fire-breathing Neeric in the first place. And how can you be sure that won't happen? There's gotta be a better way than giving up all your feelings. Guys, you gotta stop arguing. They don't like that. Cause you're not talking any sense. Um, what are they doing? Oh boy. 
be silent that's not right huh? <gasps> that's autumn isn't it it's all right I think I know this one and she's trying to help well yeah can't have them silence the only friend who'll speak to me <laughs> you have no idea Fluttershy meet autumn blaze yep <laughs> were dangerous when they're angry. How did you know you could control your temper? I didn't. Well, I guess anger's like other feelings. It's not <laughs> about having them, it's what you do with them. Exactly. Giving up happiness to keep away anger is no kind of life. Mm -mm. I never thought of it that way. I can't even imagine not being able to talk to my animals. Anger can be controlled. Burn Flare, you used to love to laugh at everything. And Rainshine, you sung the most beautiful harmonies. Don't you miss it? I know mm -hmm. you're worried about fighting, but friends can disagree without causing a ruckus. Every pony gets mad sometimes. Exactly. Even Applejack and I argue. What? When do we ever argue? Um, <clears throat> on the way here, and about the Kieran being silent, and right now! <laughs> <laughs> see? We don't always see eye to eye, but we never let that get in the way of our friendship. Mm -mm. And if you're really angry, then take some time away to be a Neeric where it won't hurt any pony. Yeah. I think they're trying to say something. Ooh, okay, I love charades. Oh no, some Kieran trapped in a well? <laughs> okay, baby, baby fish. Big, ba no, baby fish mouth? Did something? Anything? Ah, just write it down. Ooh, this is making me furious. Would you excuse me? I'll be <laughs> right back. Woo! <laughs> you were saying. <laughs> Oh! You want the cure for the stream of silence! That's wonderful! Uh, isn't it? Well, it would be, except there aren't any flowers left to make the cure. Yes, there are. Are you sure? Oh, beyond sure. Believe me, I've had a lot of alone time lately. I searched the entire forest 73 and a half times. Although I wonder if that second half could make a difference. It's outside the forest. <laughs> She told us what kind of flowers she's looking for. I know what they are. They're called bowl's breath. I've never heard of that. The squirrels, I knew it. Uh, letter shy? A little help? <laughs> she says he knows where to find fool's breath. Well, what are we waiting for? Lead the way! Yep, I knew it. <gasps> That's what fool's breath looks like? Autumn yep. never would have made it past the peaks to search here. I owe you an apology. Why? Because mm -hmm. if your kindness hadn't made you stop to help the squirrels, we never would have found this here flower. Exactly. If your honesty hadn't convinced the Kieran to talk, we wouldn't need to find it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a good thing the map sent both of us, huh? Hey, yup. You found them? Where were they? Tell me everything and feel free to add complicated descriptions and comedic tangents. <laughs> oh, right. First things first. There you go. There you go. Autumn Blaze, you have given us a gift. The realization that anger is within us, but it is our choice how we let it out. Exactly. We would very much like it if you came back to live with us. I can't say how much we've missed your beautiful voice. Aww. Repraise? Awesome. Friendship mission accomplished. 
Wow. That was amazing. I loved it. That's, that's a great lesson, you know? It just shows you anger can be controlled. You just don't let it control you and your actions. So, yeah, that was a pretty good episode. I'm sorry I had to uh, make up some re-reactions there because I uh, failed on the first reaction. But I'll try to do these reactions when there's nobody around so I don't get, you know, walked in on. So, yeah, that was a pretty good episode. I loved it. I loved the song. I hope we see these creatures again in Season 9. But I guess that's it for now. If you guys like this reaction, please let me know down below. And until next time, I'm Lazebro. I'll catch you guys later.